Hello, my name is Jay and welcome to my new Minecraft series. What we're going to do is create a new world in Hardcore, more world options and find the buffet. And we'll go down to, where is it? Plains biome in the caves of world generation. And what that's going to do is create a world that looks just like a plains biome, but inside a huge never ending cave. And what we'll do is call this map Underworld because it'll look like it's a world under a world. So let's jump on in and check it out. <sighs> okay, welcome. Since this uh, world is in a cave and is in total darkness, as you can see out the holes of this iron door, I have prepared a little bit of a bunker here for myself. Um, and I've also forced grow on a tree outside because there are no trees naturally growing so got a little bit of a safe room here if we run outside there are no mobs around just yet you can see the eyes of a spider just there but we'll hopefully be able to punch down this tree get back inside before we get our ass handed to us but we are on hardcore mode as well so if we die which is a pretty big possibility uh, that will be the end of the season unfortunately uh, so, oh, there's a zombie coming. I don't have any. I don't have any weapons or anything just yet. So he's um not going to burn up because there is no <laughs> there is no sunlight in here. Uh, so we're going to have to sort of get a bit of a weapon weapon situation going on. We'll get an axe and a pickaxe. And the good thing is we can actually start expanding our little bunker here and get a bit of cobblestone so that we can build some better tools as well. And maybe then we can deal with that zombie that's just at our door. Hopefully we'll get a bit of coal as well, make some torches so we can go out and explore a little bit, prevent some mob spawns and, and things like that. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll see how we go. Uh oh, we're being chased by creepers now too. Oh no. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Whew. Whew, 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 whew. That was close. Let's uh, upgrade our tools here a little bit, maybe. We did kill the, the one zombie that was out there. Luckily, we picked up our oak saplings as well uh, so we can grow another tree but it's just a question of whether we can get out there or not i think what i'll do is sort of head down into a little bit of a mine down here uh, so we can maybe try and find some coal and iron and things uh, so let's just mine down here and see what we can find i couldn't find any coal in my mine but there is some out here i just hope i can make it back safely there are a few zombies and skeletons out there. Oh, jeez, this is uh, this is already quite exciting. Oh, hello. Well, we've uh, got a few torches now, so we can carry on down here. Okay, so this is what our mine actually led out into. So it's just another part of the cave. Looks like there's an abandoned mine shaft over there. There's some iron right there, which I might try and grab. Um, but I don't think this is going to be too much safer than the surface. I think this is pretty much still the surface. Oh no. Let's head up and get another pick. Got my own little zombie farm going here. <laughs> Hopefully uh, someone will come in that's got some armor or something. A shortcut to armor. This is only my only food source at the moment is uh, rotten flesh as well, so it's it's uh, tasty. Mm. Got a little tree farm set up here as well. Hopefully that'll grow um, because the one out here actually hasn't. Got a creeper out here. Let's maybe see if we can do a little bit of a run around. <laughs> got a skeleton shooting at me. Light some of this place up so that we don't get as many 
spoons. Oh. Oh. Close. Got a bit too excited, but I managed to kill a skeleton outside, so hopefully this will be. No. Wow, that's that's very disappointing. Still living on rotten flesh. Um, should have maybe used that on this guy out here. Oh well, oh well, we'll uh, we'll keep trying. Really, really need some wood right now. Well, it looks like that tree outside is growing. Um, I just don't know if my my axe is going to last that long. Let's let's have a look. Well, maybe we just have to. Got him. Oh. Oh. Gotta be careful of those baby zombies that might come after us let's get this let's get this tree cut down I'll save you now we can make another pickaxe oh I see a sheep out there we we have a sheep oh my god now because of the light levels we're actually getting we, we're actually getting animals out there we have struck more iron so now we have enough iron to make at least like a, an iron pickaxe um, we'll see how many we've got in here. We've got a bit of coal here as well. We'll stop mining that and, and go for the goods. And three iron by the looks of it. So just out of that we've got enough to make an iron pickaxe or or we could make a bucket, get some of that water, get get some wheat seeds growing, get a bit get a bit of a food source going. Better than rotten flesh. I think that's probably more necessary. Um and then hopefully we can find a bit more iron down here but um, otherwise then we've got to sort of set up a little bit more of a viable tree farm because we definitely need a lot more wood Ooh, there we go more iron there we go just like that nice there's quite a bit here too and that's good spiders everywhere apparently oh well, let's head back up and get the smelting up I actually found a little bit more iron on my way back up. I thought I would um, mine out the rest of that coal there. And there were around about five ores, ores behind there, so doing pretty well now. Uh, let's just pop that in there too. We'll grab some out for some torches. And I mean, hopefully we've got um, some trees growing out there now. But we'll, we'll see. Have a, got some sheep grow. Oh, I didn't actually plant a sapling. That was silly. Let's plant one there, one there, one there, one there, one there. And do we kill these sheep for food as well? Maybe not yet. Maybe we'll get some wheat so we can start to breed them so we've got an unlimited food source. There we go, make a couple of buckets. Or maybe just one bucket for now. I'll just make one bucket for now. Yeah, that's, that's the smart thing to do. I didn't even make a bucket. So one bucket. Let's go and get some water while that's... I wonder what's down here. No, we'll go We'll go with the safe, the safe one. We'll go down here, get some water. And, um, yeah, maybe make an infinite water source in our base as well. Let's just grab the water down here. Grab some of this and put it straight back up. Easy. Actually, we might make one of these right near the exit of the mine so that we can just. Ooh. Ooh. So, yeah, I reckon if we just hang one of these off the edge, that'll do us pretty well. And then we can just jump down here, grab some water, and swim back up. Easy as that. And we'll come back in here and we'll put our infinite water source in like here, maybe. So if we mine out that, put one there, and head back down and grab another one. We do have some drowned down here, though. I don't know if that's a guy that just turned, but that's the thing. Uh, <laughs> so luckily we've... Ooh, is he... 
Oh jeez, he's swimming up here. Is he? Oh, it's because I'm out of the water. He doesn't know where I am now. Oof. But he was swimming up that thing. He was he was coming after me. And we'll pop this last one in there, and that's our infinite source all finished up. Perfect. And we've got our trees growing as well, so this is all starting to come together. Let's um, cut this one down as quickly as possible because even though we've got this place lit up, there are still mobs everywhere around. Got quite a few sheep out here now too. It's all looking, starting to look good, starting to look good. Everything's coming up. And we'll upgrade our tools to some iron tools. Get a pickaxe and... Oops, what am I doing? Jeez. You stupido. And that. This uh, tree doesn't seem to be growing, so let's get rid of that. And we'll replace it with a bit of a wheat farm here and there we go now we've got our one little wheat seed growing there the start of something new and we'll pop out here and grab all the rest of this too that actually rhymed I didn't intend for that to rhyme but it did um, oh, we've even got a chicken out here uh oh uh oh no no I'm still not quite ready to be out there and we've got an enderman here. Might as well get this one out of the way. No enderball. Well, that's a shame. Well, we are now in desperate need of some food. Uh, so maybe we can... Kill some of these. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. Sorry, um, I was kind of... Trying to concentrate there. Um, but we can. Uh oh. Uh oh. This is not good. Oh, ho, ho. Yeah, now I'm really in desperate need of food. Uh, um, if, we, if we do a little thing like that again. Got a few um, cows and sheep and chickens and stuff out here, so maybe we can somehow utilize them. We need some more wheat to grow first, though, and hopefully we can get some seeds out of these things. Maybe. Oh, oh, oh no! Make a run for it. Make a run for it. Oh no. Oh, there's actually a few. Oh sh. Oh. Jeez, every time I go out there, I just about die. Um. <laughs> no food. <sighs> what do I do? What do I do? And the holy grail is here. We were just coming down our mine shaft here, digging down to diamond level, and look at what we have found. Uh, make sure there's no mobs around uh, for me to get ganked. Definitely sounds like there are some, but oh yeah, oh yeah. First episode, first diamonds. Oh, that's what I'm talking about, guys. That is what I'm talking about. Also got quite a bit of iron ore, so that should be plenty for us to start uh, heading out into the wide open world. Um, I think we'll also make a shield here. Where are they? There it is. So now we should be safe from all these skeletons out there. Maybe we can start to get a bow as well. I'll put that on there. Sorry. And yeah. 
It almost looks like daylight out here with these torches around now, but just remembered I'm only on two hearts, so maybe we won't venture out there just yet. See if we can maybe attract the sheep or something to come in. Oh, they weren't there before. Oh, <laughs> bloody baby zombies. Also made this little uh, lookout platform here, so now we can see if there are any mobs around our base. We have a little visitor. We 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 have a visitor. Come on, come on, buddy. Can you can you get inside? Oh yeah, oh yeah. We got a we got a sheep friend. Um. Ah, oh, I didn't want to do that. I did not want to do that. Oh well, no, no! Don't don't go down there. And trapped. Now we've just got to find another one. Which now it is possible. Why are we only given one wheat seed per per wheat that we get? I thought you used to get a lot more than that. Is it because we're in hardcore? Is it trying to make things hard for us? Ha. <laughs> ha. Um. Can we get another sheep? Yes. As long as no mobs spawn, we should be okay. Come on, buddy. Come on. Over here. Over here. In here. In here, buddy. 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 Oh, yay. Finally. Let's pop that on there. Come on, in here. No, in. In. Both of you in. Both of you in. In. Yes. Now I just need one more. One more wheat. One more wheat to grow. What the hell is happening over there, though? What? Well, I made a boo boo and messed up with my recording, but we are now geared up in full iron armor. I've taken my hat off as well, uh, so just in here. This is this was really funny. I look really funny with uh, with a helmet on with my new skin. I almost look like Ant Man. But yeah, I think it's better if we take this off while we're wearing a, a helmet. Boo, normal person. Yeah. And with that. Our food source begins. Wee. Wee. Well, that is all I've got time for today, folks. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, leave a like rating and comment with your suggestions below. And it's looking like we're we're all ready to uh, venture outside on the next episode. How exciting! Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time.